Hi there, welcome to CMC. Today I'll be looking at this 2016 Ford Ranger finished in black. I'll be doing a little walk around the vehicle today showing you all the key features, details and cosmetics and I'll point out anything over and above general wear and tear. First of all we'll start out with the front end of the vehicle showing you that bonnet there. We have a few signs of general wear and tear but nothing significant, no big scratches or dents in there at all. As you can see, looking really nice. Moving down to the front end now, we'll move across those lovely clear headlights. Got no scratching or cracking in there. We'll just move across the front bumper here, down along the underside there. We've got no big marks. Got a few small marks just here on the front bumper, just up here. There you are. Also in this front grille, we do have a small, looks to be some paint defect there. That's the size of it for you. Other than that, in the front bumper and the front grille, we've got no problems, no scratching or cracking. Moving over to the front passenger side, starting with that front passenger arch, as you can see, looking really nice. And that front alloy, also looking really nice. We do have a few signs of general wear and tear, a few scratches here and there, but no significant damage and no curbing. I'll take you down the side of the vehicle now, starting with that passenger side door. Got no scratches or dings. Side steps are in good condition. Got no car park dings along that rear door there. Do you have a, a bit of a scratch just along here? It's light, you could probably polish that out. Up here, we do have a few marks as well as a very small ding in the paintwork. Maybe you can see it if I move that light across. I'll just show you that for size. There you are. Moving to the rear of the vehicle now, showing you that rear wheel arch. As you can see, looking really nice. That rear alloy, again, a few signs of wear, a few signs of damage, but no significant curbing to be seen there. Moving round to the rear of the vehicle now, showing you that rear tail light. No scratching or cracking in there at all. And the face of that tailgate, got no dings or big scratches in there. I'll open up this tailgate for you now. As you can see, we've got the heavy load liner in here. We've got no significant damage in there. No deep scratches, dents, cracks, missing pieces. Close that up. We do have a tow bar on this vehicle with the electrics hooked up, as you can see. And that rear tail light, once again, no cracking or damage in there. This rear arch, looking really nice. And this rear alloy, just like the others, a few signs of general wear, but nothing significant. Moving down the driver's side of the vehicle now, starting with that rear passenger door. Light scratch just there. Moving down to that driver's door, looking really nice. As you can see in this vehicle, we do have the 3.2 litre TDCI engine with a six speed automatic gearbox. We do have a full service history on this vehicle, with the most recent service being performed in March of 2024, with a full service MOT and gearbox oil change. Take it to the inside of the vehicle now, showing you that rear door card. Do have some scratching along the handle there, a few bits of missing paint, but no significant damage around the switches or the handle. And it's much the same on the passenger side. A few light marks on the card there and up on the handle. But the switch looks to be in good condition, as well as the door handle up there. Seats in this vehicle are in good condition. No creasing or tearing in the back here. Take you to the front of the vehicle now, showing you that driver's side door card. You can see that handle, we've got some wear. Switches look to be in good condition. Door handle, we've got no peel on. And there's your passenger side there. Very few marks in there, looking really nice. Passenger side seat in good condition, no creasing or tearing, and they can say the same. For the driver's side seat, a small bit of creasing just up there, but nothing significant. The trim is all firmly in place. We'll get inside the vehicle now, start the engine. 
and show you the infotainment system. As you can see down there, we've got 84,000 miles on this vehicle, just over. Here is your infotainment system, starting with your Bluetooth phone connectivity. Here's all your radio stations, including your AM, FM, DAB, and your Bluetooth audio just there. You've got your satellite navigation just here, and your climate control just down there. We've got dual front heated seats in this vehicle, as you can see just there, and as I highlighted earlier, the automatic gearbox. If you have any further questions or inquiries about this vehicle please do feel free to get in touch and thank you very much for watching.